What's up guys, my name is Captain Dave and welcome back to Mass Effect 3 where last time we left off we finally, finally, finally secured that Turian and Krogan alliance by curing the Genophage. It has been done, there are plenty more Krogan soon to be born onto Chunka and by doing that the Turians now have support on Palavan and because they now have that support, when the time comes, the Turians are going to help us with our fight against the Reapers. And I'm pretty certain we've probably picked up some uh, Krogan support to boot. Being a good old friend of uh, Not Rex and that. But, with that being said, just like James said in the last episode of Normandy Stories, it is time to finally go back and start putting the fight to the Reapers again. Now we've sorted out the uh, the problem onto Junker. But, before we do that, the... Um, the, ca the Salarian Counselor has asked us to meet her. I keep saying meet her. <laughs> I don't know why I always think the Salarian Counselor is a woman. Maybe because you sound like a woman. Just putting it out there. But um, the Salarian Counselor has asked us to meet him on the Citadel about a possible... Possibly Udina's... Um, well, we don't know what he's doing, but he's doing something. We need to go speak to him and find out what's going on. But before we do that, as per usual, the Reapers, as you can, look, as you can see here, have advanced and taken over more systems. So... We're probably going to go and um, stop the Cerberus fighter base here, but before we do that, we have got more systems to go in and liberate from, uh, I was about to say from the Collectors then, from the Reapers. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'll be back with you once we have gone and got more war assets from the Reapers. Okie pokey, I am back and I took the liberty of heading to the pack system. Ooh, okay, didn't see, <laughs> didn't see that planet there. I took the liberty of heading to the pack system because it is time to attack the Cerberus fighter base on Novaria of all places. Oh, <laughs> you guys all remember how Novaria was back in Mass Effect 1. Hopefully we will not be dealing with the bureaucrats this time. I uh, can't believe I'm about to say it, but let's hope we're only dealing with Cerberus. Because those bureaucrats were a pain in the bootay. Okie pokey. So, for this one, let's be taking a long... Who shall I take for this one? Let's take Edie. In a normal... Let's just take her in a normal robotic outfit. Let's take Edie and... Edie and Javik again, I feel. I think I took Evie, Edie and Javik on um, on the last uh, Cerberus one, actually, but... Oh, well, I haven't used them in a while. I haven't used Javik half as much as I want to. Same with Edie, actually. But what can I say? It's just... This is too much goodness to use with Garrus. <laughs> He's just... Storyline-wise, Garrus just works so well, but... For all those who have probably want me to switch it up a bit, don't worry, I will be switching it up. Quite soon, the um, the long streak of Garrus is coming to an end soon, so <laughs> don't worry too much. Uh, the Scorpion, I'm very much happy with uh, you still using the Scorpion. Do we have any lightweight materials? Nope, nope, nope. Let's stick with that. Damage a scope, yep, yeah, happy with that. And nope, not the Shuriken. We want you using the Tempest. Lightweight and damage. Good, good. Stick some more in Reeve. Right, what do we have? Boom. Increase damage by 10%. Increase recharge speed by 35. That's what we want. Oh, it's increased damage protection. Hmm. I mean, my recharge speed of just under 3 seconds isn't that bad right now. Normally, I always increase the um, recharge speed. But do you know what? I'm actually going to... Um, I'm actually increased damage protection. I mean, that... That's one of the reasons why I like Reeve so much. So yeah, go on, let's bulk that up a bit. Three points. I suppose I'll save him because I'm not going to put him in Shockwave. I never used the ability. It's a shame because it was so good in Mass Effect 2. And just, I feel in Mass Effect 3, Shockwave is just so bad. It's just terrible. Increase damage by additional 40% over 8 seconds. Increase recharge speed. Hmm. Let's increase that recharge speed. I know I usually normally use ED for uh, overload, but... That incinerate just burns through armor. And Javik, let's get some more lift grenades. 
duration by 50%. No, nah, no, nah, no, nah, nah. we want we, <laughs> we want more grenades. Increase that capacity. The three points. I'll wait until lift grenades fully done, then I put them in slammer pool. I mean, we've got dark channel right now, so no reason for these to waste the points in there. All right, let's go. a strategic advantage in this sector thanks to the fighter squadron facility you're about to attack. We want to seize it, but their air defenses are too strong for our frontal assault. Losses would be too cost prohibitive. How do you want me to handle this? Go in the back, bring down their defenses so we can send in the troops. Good luck, Commander. I have visual contact. There's a small platform above the main landing pad. I can drop you there, but it's gotta be now. Let's do it. Uh, what we're we using scorpion particle rifle good 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 right now that grenades out the way oh, come come on dude stand up right Edie hit uh, overload on that guy <laughs> okay, looks like they didn't want to hit that guy over there. Why waste ammo when you can just punch the guy? Knock down these shields for me, Edie. <laughs> Cover isn't too good when it's got a massive hole in it. Oh man, that guy just overkill. Right. Make sure we've definitely cleared out the area. ED, if you'd like to do the honors for me, please. Let's say when you're going around here, make sure you have a good old check around, just like you do with all the Cerberus side missions. Because there's always loot you can be picking up. I suppose I should really be focusing on the enemy. Weekly processing report, Sergeant Parker. All on-base personnel have been processed. Interrogation protocols updated successfully. When well, we all know how in Cerberus uh, interrogate by that last place we were at. Well, as Hackett said, in through the back door we go. Up you come now, buddy. <laughs> that pool had him up in the air for ages. You Glad I stayed behind cover now. Weren't intentional, but I was glad it happened. No, oh, looks like um <laughs> Javik's taking care of that guy for me. Looks like we found the control center. <laughs> looks like Javik wants to do more damage. Yeah, that's the control center, but before we go through, we have a little looky-loo around here. I'm pretty certain there's something we can loot around here somewhere. Ah, here we go. I knew we had some spare credits. Oh, and a little bit of medigel, or at least experience points. Good, good. I knew there was something we could use around here. Damn it. This will take a while. <laughs> uh, tech? Definitely, I think, Edie's thing. Edie, front and center. As you command. Be ready, Commander. You're gonna get swarmed. Commander, I've been flushed from cover. Retreating to minimum safe distance. 
No problem, Cortez. Get out of there. We'll wait for your all clear, then relay to the strike force. Warning. Warning. Security breach. Initiating lockdown radio set. Outside communications are no longer. Well, Javik, you were hoping for more. Just bring down their defense. Don't worry about that. Yes, Commander. <laughs> I didn't know if he was just uh, agreeing with what I said or if he was just excited by what was happening. Alright, I may get a lift grenade up here. I think it's about time. These guys, these guys say bye bye. Withstand the Cerberus attack. Yeah, they're not doing much of a good job right now. <laughs> Anybody else? Bit of a wimpy attack, if you ask me. Here we go. This is a bit more like it. <laughs> Where are they all? This is the easiest uh, stronghold I've ever had to hold down. Oh, Javix found somebody. So have I. Shepard, it appears that shutdown requires a synchronous command. Defense system deactivated. General order 7/7 triggered. Establish contingency defenses. Surface is deploying manual defenses to the landing pad, Shepard. And that's where we need to go. It is done. Yeah, well, to do that, you guys might need to follow me. Because we have company! Javik, how about you get another grenade up there for me? <laughs> that dude has an arm on him, doesn't he? Good man. Nope. Second I use e these incinerate, and then a guy jumps down with a shield. Just <laughs> perfect timing. Right when I could have used their overload. Oh, I'm behind you, buddy. Or at least from the side of you. Oh, no. I hear a turret. Where's the engineer at? ED, take down this guy's shields. Don't worry, I see the turret in the background. Is it? Engineer gonna all pop his head out. There he goes. Oh, those lift grenades are just far too good. Cortez, I read you. Come in. Unload. Give it everything you've got. Holy! <laughs> okay. Uh, overload. You hit with a lift for grenade. Don't think it's going to do anything, but I did a lot more than I thought it was going to. <laughs> Anyone wounded? That shouldn't matter. Well, I care about you, Javik. Copy that, Lieutenant. Coming in to pick you up. <laughs> wow, that Atlas was a scrub. <laughs> he got destroyed so fast. Well, that's what happens when you get have a vengeful Prothean with you. <laughs> This was a major victory, Commander. A crippling blow to Cerberus operations in this sector. Now all we have to do is maintain control of the facility. Cerberus won't make that easy. And we won't make it easy on them. Thanks to you, we can use their own defenses against them. Tell your team they did good, Commander. You should be proud. Thank you, sir. That's all. Hack it out. Thank you for the praise, Hackett. Thank you a lot. But anyway, that is that Cerberus. What do you call it? Taken down, at least for now. Cerberus just keeps knocking them up, and we just keep bashing them straight back down again. <laughs> Give it all you got, Cerberus. Every time they send more our way, it's just more war assets for us.
I mean, look down at the uh, effective military strength at the moment. <laughs> We've racked up way more than the bare minimum, and we just keep on going. At this rate, I think the Reapers aren't going to stand a chance. The only thing I've really got left to do is... um. Should really start playing a little bit of multiplayer, I do believe. Or at least at the point of recording this, I haven't uh, been playing any multiplayer. Because although we've got quite an effective military strength at the moment, uh, our uh, readiness rating is still sitting not too great at 50%. So maybe I better better get on that. As I say, it's not essential, by the way, the uh, readiness rating, like the multiplayer. You don't have to play it. I mean, it's not like you're going to lose if you don't. It just... It just helps, Masso. It just helps your uh, overall rating, if you see what I mean. But, I mean, if you... Yeah, let's go switch to the war map. But, I mean, looking at this, I mean, they're all 50%. That's only, as I said, they're right at the very start. That's only done by playing the multiplayer. If that's all still at 50% when you get to the end of the game, it doesn't really affect you too much. I wouldn't worry uh, a whole heap. But I, for one, I'm going to try and smack all of that up to 100% by the time we get to the end of the game. Which I suppose really I should <laughs> I should really get working on right about now. Ah, what can I say? There's too much Reaper butt to be kicked right now for to be messing around with small fry stuff like that. So Sarah, how about your buddy? The one who joined Cerberus. You heard from him? No, I cut ties. Reported him for whatever good that did. No way I want that crap on my record. No, it's a bit cold, but to be honest, the way your buddy has probably ended up that's Pretty much, probably a good idea you did that. You've got new messages, Commander. Cheers, trainer. Commander. Uh, not Bakara. Well, obviously, if you feel like you want to give this one a read, which I always thoroughly, thoroughly suggest you do, feel free to pull the video and give that one a read. But as for now, I think we're going to call that one quits. As for next time, we have got everything. Oh, well, oh, looking at the wrong... Oh, God, I'm looking at the wrong stuff again. That is everything done for now. The only thing we really have to do now is head to the Citadel and have that meeting with the uh, Solarian Counselor. But I will save that for next time. Oh, actually, what am I talking about? I believe we level. Oh, I thought we leveled up while we were there. My mistake. As for now, I'm going to catch you guys later.